Last night, when I when it came back to me about this dream that I had, I totally forgot it. And I I don't know, I don't normally, I don't normally, um, this was like last week or a couple days ago. I mean, I saw it as clear as day. I mean, just the way I'm standing outside on the roof right now. I saw this because I prayed a prayer to God. And in this dream, he didn't show me that same night. In this dream, I mean, it happened. He showed me exactly what I asked for. When God showed me something, there's always light. There's always light in the vision. There's always light in the vision. Early this year, let, let me start again. Early this year was the first time, or I think it was in March, when Charles came down here, um, minister, preacher, prophet by the name of Joshua Giles. He was just on Sid Roth the other day. Um, we invited him down here. He was the first person that I heard speak about a wealth transfer. He even has a book out that's called Prophetic Forecast, you know. So, he prophesied over me. I got the video. I watched it. I watched it the other day. I watched it from time to time to, to get myself, you know, to keep myself uh, in that hope of what God has said. So, he said there's going to be a transfer. All right? And before even Joshua came down here, when I learned how to uh, do crypto the hard way, we did it such a hard way, like it was such a hard way. But this coin that has a dog on it, and no, I'm not talking about Dogecoin. It's called the Shiba coin. The Shiba Inu coin. Shiba coin was the very first coin was the very first coin that I got. I was walking into Walmart and this video popped up and said, Shiba Inu coin will, um, will um, go to 50 cents. And I believe God allowed me to see that for a reason. I, just, I can't even lie. I believe God allowed me to see that, that one. It wasn't not another coin. It won't, it's a bunch of coins, but I'm telling you, God strategically wanted me to see that video. Strategically put planted it right there. Out of all the, out of all the coins, it was that one. So, this one of them. I only, I only carry two coins now. I had a bunch of them, light coin, all that. So, I hit him a good friend. Call, call, call. The one pick up the phone. Pick him, trying to cause we were, we were doing it together one night, learning it together. I was trying. I'm like, God dog it. And they wouldn't answer the phone for nothing because they're on the other side of the world and it is. If it's nighttime over there, it's daytime over there. If it's daytime over there, it's nighttime over there. This person, they helped me learn. So I was trying to get in contact with them. And um, it was always, when I got it, when I got it, I had like 24 million Shiba coin. It was worth like 300 and some dollars. All right. So I was like, uh, I was like, we got it, and God was like, just hold it. Just keep it. Just keep it. It's way early in the year. Just keep it. I'm like, okay. Then the market started going down. Everything started going down. It was, it was a good thing that because you can buy back cheaper. But at the same time, the money I had in there was was I was losing it. I was losing it all. It, even though I would have still had my coins, but now I bought it back at a cheaper price. So as time went along, Joshua came down here. He said what he had to say. And God I always just had on my heart. I, I sold my Shiba Inu coin because the market was coming down. I sold it, boom. Then Lord was like, you need to get it back. I got it back, the market was going down some more, I sold it, boom. The Lord was like, you need to get it back. And it just, the unction in me was this, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. So I'm like, I'm telling my good friend, I'm like, listen, I feel like the Lord, you know, well, they were thinking like, oh, it's just a mean coin. I was thinking it wasn't gonna do nothing. But I know that I heard God tell me, uh, get the Sheba in new coin. Listen to me now. If you dealing with crypto, you better get it because it's 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 a what's gonna happen when people ain't is not gonna expect it. So I was praying to God like two weeks ago. I said, God, because I didn't want to put my money in something that you know I was gonna lose. Of course, crypto is is uh, risk, risky, but you know it is what it is. Stock market, but. 
Joshua said, God going to give you economic insight on where you ought to put your money. He told me this. He said, God going to tell you. So I'm telling you, I know what I'm, I'm talking about right now. You ain't got to listen to me. I don't give a dang. But I'm going to tell you right now. I, when, when, how I know I got the economic insight is when, when God tells me something, see, his old, when you obedient to God, he tells you something you know. It ain't even no question. Sometimes you may question a little bit, but you know it's going to be something in you just like, no, I think I ought to do this because that's God telling me. That's how I was, that's how I was feeling the whole time about Sheba. I was like, I'm like, man, I think I need to get this corn. All right. I said, I was driving down the road, heading to the country. I said, God, if you want me to get this corn, please give me a sign. And the, and the sign was this. Show me a dog in the road. I said, show me a dog. I said, if the corn is good, show me a dog. Walk across the road or in the road. However, let him be on the road. Or show me a dead dog. That's what I told him. I said, well, show me a dead dog right now. I said, I said, and when I was going, I know the houses, I know who had dogs and whatnot, because I go through this, this road all the time. I don't want to see they dog. I see they dog every time I come through here. I want to see something unexpected. I said, I know who got dogs around here. I don't want to see they dog. When I was going through that neighborhood, I didn't even I didn't see they dog. Not one time. I didn't see the dog. This is God just helping giving me confirmation. But this ain't it. So I made it to the end of the road all the way out in Farm Haven. Going through the back going through the back road through the country. I see a motorcycle come by with a dog on it. So I looked, I said, it was a little dog. I was like, I said, hold up. Because when it went by so fast, it was like, zoom. And I saw it was like a little small dog. So I was kind of like, was that a dog? That's how I was looking. I'm like, God, was that a dog? And I'm like, that's a dog. It was a little dog. But I was confused. I'm like, God, the motorcycle went by so fast. It was not one of the fast motorcycles, just one of the cruisers where it had a seat at the back. So I was like, God, I think I saw the dog, but I need confirmation. I said, Lord, if you want me to get this coin, if you want me to get this coin, if this coin gonna do something, show me a dog in a row. It wasn't that same night, but a couple nights later, I was standing up. I was standing up. I was at a, like a four-way stop. Light shining everywhere. Woo! Cars with dogs going this way, going that way, going this way, going that way, going this way, going, and they were all in the back window with their tongue hanging out. Going, and I was standing, I was like, Man, there's a lot of dogs. It was so real. I thought I was at the grocery store. It was so real. I thought I was at the grocery store. Like, it was so real. I forgot. I thought. I, I, for, I don't know how I forgot it. I don't know how I forgot this dream. Like, it just left me. It left me. And I was thinking, was this real? Like, was I? I, I was, Cause it was, I was like, was I somewhere when I'm, cause I remember I was talking to my good friend. I'm like, and I was telling about it. It was just an unction on me. I was like, man, I feel like God told me to get there. You know, they were like, well, it's just a mean coin. And like I said, I thought the same thing too. A mean coin just, it ain't nothing. It's just a business trying to make money. So I was like, I'm like, but I feel, and I was telling them, man, just trust me, just trust me. I think the Lord is telling me to do this. And then I was, but I couldn't remember this dream. And when I was speaking to him, it came to me. I said, hold up. I said, hold up. I said, hold up. I said, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Cause it started coming back to my memory because I was asking God, God let me know. I said, I seen something when I went to bed. And man, when I tell you, I didn't even know, I forgot that I had a dream. Let me tell you something, that corn is going, it ain't about the corn. It's what God want to do. The corn right now is under a penny. I know it, I saw it, I'm telling you, I, it wasn't a dream, it was a vision, it was an experience. I was standing, I remember the grass on the ground, I remember the trees, I remember the vehicle, it was a van went by, it was a black car that went by, and these dogs were in the backseat of these cars going everywhere, everywhere. So I'm gonna tell you right now, God, if you don't get it, it's on you.